Hi everyone, this is Jaime and Umberto from Chop and Chops MMA. At Chop and Chops, we offer Brazilian Jiu Jitsu classes for children. For new children, we offer a free trial week. During the trial week, we want to see if the kid is enjoying the classes, number one, and also is the, if the class is good for the child. So our trial week begins on Monday. It's not a good idea to start later in the week because the way that we do our training blocks is we start on Monday and we build off of that. At the end of the week is the accumulation. So we really want to start in on Monday. We might be able to push it off one day, but more than that, it's better to schedule a different week. So if the kid comes in later in the week, he's gonna feel a little behind for the rest of the class. What you need when you start the trial week is just to have Clean clothes, uh, something that the child is gonna sweat in because it is a very active sport. We want them to have uh, trim nails, trim toenails because we don't want anyone to get scratched by accident. Uh, no jewelry, same thing. We don't want them to get scratched and please make sure that the clothes don't have any zippers on them. Again, we don't want children to get scratched. So we're trying to evaluate the child uh, to see if the child fits, to see if the school fits for the child. Uh, and we, in order to do that, we need him to be here multiple times. You can't just come in once. Uh, we need to see him at least three, four times for the week. If you want to book the trial week, you can just go to our website under the kids tab. We have an online calendar. So it's good to book the week sooner rather than later because we only allow one family to, to try the gym out at a time. So the minimum age is seven. And the big reasons for that is mostly safety. Number one, we want to make sure that your child is uh, big enough to be in the class. Uh, also, we want to make sure that the child has enough body awareness that they're not going to accidentally hurt another, one of their training partners. And of course, we also look for emotional maturity. The child needs to be able to, uh, to listen to us when we talk. He need, they need to be able to pay attention. And we really feel that the minimum for that is seven years old. At the end of every class, there's active sparring. So we're not just theoretically doing moves. They will be wrestling with each other. That includes joint locks, that includes chokes. They will be pinning each other to the floor. So uh, your kid will have to have the emotional, the emotional regulation to keep calm under that. We will train that into them. We can help them with that, but we have to have them have a sense of awareness and a sense of safety. So. This martial art does have a ranking system. It is, for, it is in the form of belts. Uh, we don't have a belt promotion scheduled. Whenever a child has reached the point where it's time for them to get a new belt, we give it to them. We can always tell you the parents if you guys want to come by, you can take pictures of it, but we tend to not have one day where everyone's gonna get a belt or something or some type of reward. So there are local competitions that occur throughout the year. They happen in Brooklyn. Um, we have some of our members compete. We encourage them to compete. If your child does want to compete, we will help them with that. If you have any other questions, you could always reach out to us at kids at choppingchopsmma.com. Check out our website. We put all the information there. I encourage everyone to look at the website first. And if you have any questions after that, please send us an email.